This lesson deals with supplemental problem 16.2. You can find this problem in the ECE 202 ebook in the chapter 16 supplemental problems on page 2. For the plant that was in supplemental problem 16.1, can you specify the capacitance needed to correct the power factor from 0.707 lagging to 0.9 lagging? And what would be the rated voltage on this capacitor? We had complex power in the previous supplemental problem to be 120K plus J120K. Now we're trying to create a new value for that complex power to raise our power factor. So we're going to need to reduce the value of the imaginary part. So let's say minus JQ. Let's just call this X for right now. So the value of theta for our new value of complex power, let's use quotes around it, is the inverse cosine of 0.9. And that's 25.84 degrees. But that's going to be the arctangent of the imaginary over the real, because that's the angle of the complex power. I take the tangent of both sides of the equation, so the tangent of 25.84 is 0.4843, and then the tangent of the arctangent is just the argument, which is x over 120k. So now I can solve for x. Then x is equal to 120k times 0.4843, and that's 58.11 thousand. Again, that has to equal 120k minus q. So let's solve for q now. It's going to be equal to, bring it the other side of the equation, I'm going to have 120k minus 58.11k, and that's 61.89k. Then from page 5 in the chapter 16 notes, we showed that the value of Q was the magnitude of the capacitor current squared times the reactance of the capacitor. Okay, but that current is also the magnitude of the voltage squared divided by the reactance squared. One of these cancels, and I'm left with X of C, which is 1 over omega C. So now I can solve for the capacitor value. So we take the value of Q, which is 61.89K, and divide that by 2 pi F, which is at 60 hertz, and then the magnitude of my voltage, which is a 4,000 volt RMS signal. I get a value of 10.266 microfarads. The value of the capacitor voltage is going to be the RMS value times the square root of 2. That would be the peak value. That would be 5.657 kilovolts. And this is supplemental problem 16.2.